when the second generation of Pokemon is released into Pokemon Go, who are you going to pick? How many times have you seen Zubat on your new buy and just thought, I gotta have it? Probably ever, right? With rumors of next-gen Pokemon being released into Pokemon Go in the sometime near future, that state of mind has got to change. This bench is wet. According to an awesome Pokemon Go website, Pokemon Go Hack, link right here, the best way to prepare for the release of second-gen Pokemon is to start saving candies for those Pokemon that have a, another evolution form in next-gen. One of these Pokemon being Eevee. Eevee will get an additional two evolutions. Umbreon and Espeon. Something to look out for for these evolutions is the renaming of them. So much like the Easter egg for the first three evolutions, it can be assumed that this will apply for Gen 2. Try renaming your Eevee according to the trainers in their anime. For an Espeon, try naming it Sakura. For an Umbreon, try renaming it Gary Oak. Back to the Zubat thing. Zubat also gains another evolution in Generation 2. Zubat turns into Golbat, turns into Crobat. And as for most tier 3 evolutions, it can be assumed to cost 100 candies. Oddish is another Pokemon that gains a second tier 3 evolution, known as Velocity. Now it's unsure whether or not Velocity will be random or somehow predetermined. But what is sure is that it should cost about 100 candies to evolve into a blossom. This video is coming to you live from my community college, so I am currently the weirdo walking around with a tripod. Kingdra is another new third evolution Pokemon. It is the third stage of Horsey. The cool thing about Kingdra is he is a mix water and dragon type Pokemon, which is something Pokemon Go could really use. Expect Kingdra to cost you another 100 candies since it is the third evolution form. Politoed is another evolution of Poliwag, so you can expect this guy to set you back another 100 candies. Keeping in mind that this is a second tier 3 Pokemon, this is the second, third evolution stage of Poliwag. Cypher really needs a buff. Bug type Pokemon are really weak in Generation 1. Scissor, or however you want to say it, is the evolution form of Scyther, which is a dual bug and steel type Pokemon. This is a second stage evolution that should cost you 50 candies. Steelix is another Pokemon in which you could look forward to. Steelix is a dual steel and ground type Pokemon with amazing defensive stats. And since it is a second tier evolution, 50 candies will probably get the job done. Another Pokemon to look forward to is Slowking. Personally, I am most excited for this one in Generation 2, just because I think he looks super cool with the little shell on his head. Similar to Slowbro, he is an evolution of Slowpoke, meaning this evolution should cost you 50 candies. Another new Pokemon is Blissey. Blissey is the next evolution form of Chansey. Your best bet in getting Blissey is really just setting Chansey as your buddy Pokemon, unless you want to hatch four Chanseys out of a 10k egg. So start walking your Chanseys now if you want a Blissey. And one of the final Pokemon with another evolution form in Generation 2 is Porygon 2, another extremely rare Pokemon. This is, of course, the evolution of the original Porygon and should set you back 50 candies. <sighs> okay, now it's really starting to rain. Alright, next up, these. Okay, all those eggs I showed you earlier, they're ready. In risk of canceling all the animations with my eggs, I'm gonna get my phone screen set up. Apparently, this egg hatched itself for me. We got a Jigglypuff. And... Charmander! Oh, man! Yes! I've only caught one Charmander besides my starter. Geodude. 
Yeah, all these eggs are from, that's right, uh, California. Caterpie, not so much. <sighs> Make it a good one. Nothing's gonna be Charmander. He's my favorite star, there's no way. Definitely not. <sighs> With those results, I don't know how well you can tell how much where you get the Pokemon A correlates to what Pokemon you get. But anyways, guys, I am going to wrap this video up. It is getting dark, it's getting rainy, and I have about an hour drive home. So if you like this video, let me know. Give me a thumbs up if you did. And until next time, it's your girl, Unlike Ike. I'm out. We have a 97 point. 8% perfect Vulpix. So let's hit evolve on this little dude and let's see what we get. For Nine Tails, it's the same thing as Ponyta Ember and Fire Blast. Do that.